A number of significant scientific events occurred in 2015. Gene editing based on CRISPR got significantly improved. A new human-like species, Homo naledi, was first described. Gravitational waves were observed for the first time announced publicly in 2016, and dwarf planets Pluto and Ceres were visited by spacecrafts for the first time. The United Nations declared 2015 the International Year of Soils and Light-Based Technologies. Events January The 2nd of January, a study published in Science shows evidence that a protein partially assembles another protein without genetic instructions. Defying textbook science, amino acids, the building blocks of a protein, can be assembled by another protein and without genetic instructions. The 3rd of January, Iranian chemists from Ferdowsi University of Mashhad created biodiesel fuel from soya oil to decrease pollutions caused by fossil fuels. The 5th of January, scientists from the US and UK have mapped the genome of the bowhead whale and identified genes responsible for its 200-year lifespan, the longest of any mammal. The Japan Meteorological Agency JMA declares 2014 as the hottest year on record globally, surpassing the previous record of 1998. Researchers have developed a compound that causes the metabolism of mice to respond as if a meal has been eaten, so they burn fat to make room for new calories. Human trials could follow within two years. An earthquake felt by Ohio residents in March 2014 was caused by fracking, a study has found. NASA reports observing an X-ray flare 400 times brighter than usual, a record breaker, from the supermassive black hole, named Sagittarius A** in the center of the Milky Way galaxy. The unusual event may have been caused by the breaking apart of an asteroid falling into the black hole or by the entanglement of magnetic field lines within gas flowing into Sagittarius A**. The 6th of January Astronomers have developed a method of accurately telling a star's age from how fast it spins. NASA announces the 1,000th confirmed exoplanet discovered by the Kepler Space Telescope. Three of the newly confirmed exoplanets were found to orbit within habitable zones of their related stars, two of the three, Kepler 438b and Kepler 442b, are near Earth size and likely rocky, the third, Kepler 440b, is a super-Earth. 7 January Humans are eroding soil a hundred times faster than natural processes, according to a new study. If global warming is to be kept below 2 degrees Celsius this century, then over 80% of coal, 50% of gas and 30% of oil reserves are unburnable, a new study concludes. A review article published in the journal Neuron describes a number of recent studies showing that brain imaging can help predict a person's future learning, criminality, health-related behaviors, and response to drug or behavioral treatments. In a world first, researchers from New Zealand have observed mitochondrial DNA moving between cells in mice and triggering cancer growth. Tarbiat Madaras University researchers produce ceramic nonporous membrane with high thermal firmness. The 8th of January NASA reports determining, with a high degree of accuracy, the precise center of the planet Saturn and its family of moons, to within 4 kilometers 2.5 miles. Astronomers have observed and measured a neutron star slipping out of view because of the warp in space-time its orbit creates. 
The star is expected to reappear in about 160 years. The 9th of January A new species of ichthyosaur resembling a dolphin merged with a crocodile has been discovered in Scotland. Deersimhara Chakra C lived in the early to mid-Jurassic about 170 million years ago. Iranian and Argentinian researchers made a biosensor by using graphene sheets. Iranian researchers from University of Tehran applied nanocomposite covering to enhance the strength and lifetime of concrete compositions. 13 January, the first lab-grown, contracting human muscle is announced by Duke University. 14 January NASA and ESA celebrate 10 years since the Cassini-Huygens probe landed on Titan, largest moon of the planet Saturn, related image. By the year 2050, almost nobody under the age of 80 will die of cancer, according to a study by University College London. The acceleration in global sea level rise during recent decades has been significantly underestimated, according to a new Harvard study. The 15th of January researchers have extended the lifespan of fruit flies by 60%, using a method that could one day lead to anti-aging treatments for humans. A series of 24 global indicators, published in the journal Anthropocene Review, show how the impact of humans is now the primary driver of the Earth system. Iranian scientists from University of Tehran produced a sensor that calculates the amount of blood sugar of diabetics by measuring acetone concentration in their expiration. The 16th of January NASA reports the Beagle 2, built by the United Kingdom, thought to be lost on the planet Mars since 2003, has been found on the surface in Isidus Planitia location is about 11.5265 degrees north 90.4295 degrees east, 11.5265, 90.4295. High resolution images captured by the Mars reconnaissance Reconnaissance orbiter identify the lost probe, which appears to be intact. See discovery images here. NASA and NOAA confirm that 2014 was the hottest year on record globally. The 19th of January NASA presents an animated view of the dwarf planet Ceres by the approaching Dawn spacecraft. Animated images 20,150,113 and 20,150,204 by observing the gravitational effects on extreme trans-Neptunian objects (ETNOs). Astronomers have theorized that a pair of Earth-sized objects may be hidden at the edge edge of the solar system the 20th of january long term carbon sequestration as a way of mitigating climate change may be harder to achieve than previously thought due to difficulties in converting the gas to a solid state mit reports the 22nd of January by recreating the conditions on Earth during the Chicxulub impact, researchers have concluded that the heat pulse nearer the crater was too short-lived to ignite significant amounts of plant matter. By contrast, regions much further away would have experienced less intense, but longer-lived heat levels up to seven minutes, long enough to ignite plant matter. This challenges previous theories about global firestorms in the aftermath of the event. As part of the Open Worm project, scientists have mapped the brain of a roundworm C. Elegans, created software to mimic its nervous system and uploaded it to a Lego robot, which seeks food and avoids obstacles. The 23rd of January scientists have slowed the speed of light by using a special mask to change the shape of photons. With a successful new method, Iranian scientists managed to create a graphene-based gas sensor, which has uses in many industries to detect oxygen. The 25th of January, a new owl species in the Middle East, the desert tawny owl Strix is described. 
The 26th of January chemists determine that alkali metals explode on contact with water due to a coulomb explosion at the water metal interface driving the reaction instead of merely due to hydrogen gas formation and its subsequent ignition. This overturns what was previously considered to be a well understood phenomenon and has the potential to increase safety when handling reactive metals. Iranian nanotechnologists drafted and constructed solar cells for transforming solar energy into electricity. The 27th of January astronomers have discovered an exoplanet with a gigantic ring system that is 200 times larger than that around Saturn. NASA reports that the Kepler spacecraft confirmed five sub-Earth-sized rocky exoplanets, all smaller than the planet Venus, but bigger than the planet Mercury, in orbit around the 11.2 billion-year-old star Kepler-444, making this planetary system, at more than 80% of the age of the universe, the oldest yet discovered. According to NASA, no life as we know it could exist on these hot exoplanets, due to their close orbital distances to the host star. The 28th of January, an ingredient found in green tea may protect against oral cancer, according to Penn State University researchers. The 29th of January, global warming will result in large storms becoming larger, rather than an increase in the number of storms, concludes a study by the University of Toronto. The 30th of January, a joint study of data from the Planck Space Mission and the ground-based experiment BICEP-2 casts doubt on earlier findings of gravitational waves from the Big Bang. The 31st of January, NASA launches the Soil Moisture Active Passive SMAP Observatory. It will provide the most accurate, highest resolution global measurements of soil moisture ever obtained from space. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> February. The 2nd of February, a study about pentagraphene, a proposed carbon allotrope, is published. The 3rd of February, the British government votes to allow a controversial new technique involving babies created from three people. If passed by the House of Lords, the UK will become the first country in the world to offer this medical procedure, which can be used to treat mitochondrial diseases. For the first time, researchers have used biodegradable nanoparticles to kill brain cancer cells in animals and lengthen their survival. The FDA approves a new drug, Ibrantz palbocyclib, for treating advanced breast cancer. The first transistors made from silicene, a one-atom thick version of silicon, are reported. The 4th of February. Scientists have genetically reprogrammed plants to be drought tolerant in response to an already existing agrochemical, circumventing the need for a new chemical that would otherwise have required many years of testing. E-cigarettes cause many of the same harmful effects as normal cigarettes, according to a new study on mice. The 5th of February, the first generation of stars is now thought to have emerged 560 million years after the Big Bang, according to scientists working on the European Planck satellite. This is 140 million years later than the previous estimate of 420 million years. The 6th of February, Iranian nanotechnologists discovered key to measure species in liquids. In this study, the aim was to withdraw and measure vitamin B12 from liquid models. The 9th of February, researchers have extracted isopropanol fuel from genetically engineered bacteria and solar-powered catalysts, achieving the same efficiency as photosynthesis. The 10th of February, NASA releases a smiley 
Image of Galaxy Cluster SDSS J1038 plus 4849 and gravitational lensing an Einstein ring taken by the Hubble Space Telescope. NASA scientists present the notion that comets are like deep fried ice cream. Since research studies suggest comet surfaces are formed of a mixture of organic compounds and dense crystalline ice, while comet interiors contain colder and less dense ice. Iranian and Finnish researchers made a magnetic nanosorbent that adsorbs 60-100% of nitrate and nitrite in the sample of soil and water. The 11th of February NASA's Deep Space Climate Observatory DSCOVR, is launched by a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket. It will measure solar winds and provide crucial early warnings during solar flares. ESA's Intermediate Experimental Vehicle IXV, demonstrates a new atmospheric re-entry technology, returning from space to Earth similar to the Space Shuttle but without wings. A study in the New England Journal of Medicine reports that mortality due to cigarette smoking in the United States is substantially greater than previously thought. Iranian experimenters from Sahand University of Technology and Islamic Azad University examined the effect of applying nanoparticles on rice oil extraction from supplies. 12 February, researchers have calculated that between 4.8 and 12.7 million metric tons of plastic entered the ocean in 2010 from people living within 50 kilometers of the coastline. The 13th of February, scientists including Jeffrey Marcy, Seth Shostak, Frank Drake, Elon Musk and David Brin at a convention of the American Association for the Advancement of Science, discuss active SETI and whether transmitting a message to possible intelligent extraterrestrials in the cosmos is a good idea. One result was a statement, signed by many, that a Worldwide scientific, political and humanitarian discussion must occur before any message is sent. The 16th of February New research by King's College London suggests the risk of psychosis is three times higher for users of potent, skunk-like, cannabis than for non-users. Mars 1 selects its final 100 astronaut candidates. Iranian scientists planned a new technique to cure of Wilson's disease. The study gave a modern nano arrangement with more healing skill in cell culture form. The nanostructure consists of a bio well matched polymeric nanocarrier that facilitates the penetration into the cell without making of toxicity with high effectiveness. Iranian nanotechnologists synthesized the latest scheme nano pill of bio-adaptable and biodegradable chain molecular which is able to ebb toxicity of anti-cancer drugs. This modern medicine is considered for treating breast cancer. The 18th of February, limpet teeth might be the strongest known natural material, a new study has found. The 19th of February. A regulator of gene activity known as HARE5 human accelerated regulatory enhancer is found to make human brains bigger. Iranian scientists achieved in devising of a biosensor to determine dopamine level, which has high detection border and go down clinical diagnosis expenses due to its high correctness and rate. The 20th of February, drug-resistant malaria has been detected at the Myanmar-India border and now poses an enormous threat to global health, scientists have said. The 26th of February. The U.S. Federal Communications Commission FCC rules in favor of net neutrality by adopting Title II common carrier of the Communications Act of 1934 and Section 706 of the Telecommunications Act of 1996 to the Internet. The FCC chairman, Tom Wheeler, commented, 
This is no more a plan to regulate the Internet than the First Amendment is a plan to regulate free speech. They both stand for the same concept. Physicists present an alternative cosmological view to extend the Big Bang model, suggesting the universe had no beginning or singularity and the age of the universe is infinite. The 27th of February A new study examining the role of oceanic cycles in heat transfer concludes that the global warming pause is only temporary and that temperatures will accelerate in the near future. The number of wild giant pandas has increased by nearly 17% over the last decade, according to a new survey conducted by the Chinese government. <laughs> March The 1st of March, SanDisk announces the first 200 gigabytes capacity micro SD card, a 56% increase on its previous record of 128 gigabytes just a year earlier. The 2nd of March, scientists have captured the first ever image of light as both a particle and a wave. The 3rd of March, the Food and Drug Administration FDA states that neither the benefits nor the safety of testosterone have been established for low testosterone levels due to aging and has required that testosterone pharmaceutical labels include warning information about the possibility of an increased risk of heart attacks and stroke. NASA reports that, for the first time, complex DNA and RNA organic compounds of life, including uracil, cytosine and thymine, have been formed in the laboratory under outer space conditions, using starting chemicals, such as pyrimidine, found in meteorites. Pyrimidine, like polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons PAHs, the most carbon-rich chemical found in the universe, may have been formed in red giants or in interstellar dust and gas clouds, according to the scientists. The 4th of March, a 2.8 million year old jawbone may be the oldest human fossil in existence, according to two papers published simultaneously in Science. Researchers now suspect that Homo, the genus that includes modern humans, dates back at least 400,000 years earlier than previously thought. The 5th of March. Evidence for a vast ancient ocean that once covered most of the northern hemisphere on Mars is reported by NASA. Astronomers have discovered the fastest known star, which is being ejected from the galaxy by a supernova explosion. Its hypervelocity of 1,200 km per second 2.7 million miles per hour is high enough to escape the gravitational pull of the Milky Way. The number of people affected by river flooding could nearly triple by 2030, according to a new analysis. The 6th of March A pioneering therapy using bone marrow stem cells to treat lung cancer patients is announced in the UK. Archaeologists report finding two lost cities deep in the Honduras jungle, thought to be untouched by humans for at least 600 years. The Dawn spacecraft begins to orbit Ceres, becoming the first spacecraft to visit a dwarf planet. The 7th of March, Iranian nanotechnologists created a modern sort of electrical insulator with elevated dielectric constant. This achievement is used in electronics, optoelectronics and electrochemical factories. The 9th of March, Solar Impulse begins its round-the-world flight, aiming to become the first plane to circumnavigate the globe using only energy from the sun. A new class of drugs known as senolytics has been shown to improve multiple aspects of aging in mice. The 11th of March The rocket engine of NASA's space launch system, the most powerful booster ever built, has its first ground test, with officials claiming a perfect result. 
NASA's Cassini spacecraft provides the first clear evidence of hydrothermal activity on Saturn's moon Enceladus, which may resemble that seen in the deep oceans on Earth and is likely the most habitable off-world environment ever found. Photos emerge of a newly formed island near Tonga in the Pacific, created as a result of volcanic activity. A breakthrough in carbon capture technology allows the process to be undertaken with half as much energy as previous methods. The 12th of March A new method for treating Alzheimer's with ultrasound has been demonstrated in mice, completely clearing the amyloid plaques in 75% of the animals. Hubble's views of Ganymede's aurorae suggest the Moon, Jupiter's largest, may contain a vast subsurface saline ocean. The U.S. Federal Communications Commission releases the specific details of the net neutrality rules. The 17th of March, lava tubes big enough to house entire cities could be structurally stable on the Moon, according to a theoretical study presented at the Lunar and Planetary Science Conference. The 18th of March, NASA reports the detection of an aurora that is not fully understood and an unexplained dust cloud in the atmosphere of the planet Mars. A 30-year land-based study of the Amazon, the most extensive ever conducted, shows the rainforest is gradually losing its ability to absorb carbon from the atmosphere, as trees die at faster and faster rates. The 19th of March The National Snow and Ice Data Center reports that Arctic sea ice reached its lowest ever maximum extent. Using data from SOFIA, it is discovered that planets may be formed from supernova remnant ejecta. Scientists report on a genetic modification that can spread much quicker than conventional genetics would allow, copying itself to other chromosomes with CRISPRs. Possible applications include malaria-resistant mosquitoes. Scientists, including an inventor of CRISPR, urge a worldwide moratorium on using gene editing methods to genetically engineer the human genome in a way that can be inherited, writing, Scientists should avoid even attempting, in lax jurisdictions, germline genome modification for clinical application in humans. Until the full implications are discussed among scientific and governmental organizations. The 20th of March, a total solar eclipse occurs, visible over much of Europe. The 22nd of March, DNA from the extinct woolly mammoth is spliced into that of an elephant and shown to be functional for the first time. The 24th of March, NASA reports the first detection of nitrogen released after heating surface sediments on the planet Mars. The nitrogen, in the form of nitric oxide, was detected by the SAM instrument on the Curiosity rover and can be used by living organisms. The discovery supports the notion that ancient Mars may have been habitable for life. The frog species Pristimantis mutabilis is described in the Zoological Journal of the Linnean Society. A temperature of 17.5 degrees Celsius .5 degrees Fahrenheit is recorded in the Antarctic Peninsula, the highest ever seen on the continent. The region is one of the fastest warming spots on Earth. Iranian chemists modeled and resolved nonlinear dynamic treatment and vulnerability of nanostructures in the presence of external driving factors. The 25th of March A new technique has successfully entangled 3,000 atoms using only a single photon, the largest number of particles that have ever been mutually entangled experimentally. Iranian researchers reduce costly materials from diabetes diagnosis sensors. They devised and created a non-enzyme biosensor at the laboratorial scale to notice diabetes. The 26th of March 
The ice around the edge of Antarctica is melting faster than previously thought, researchers have warned. A nanoparticle therapy has been shown to accelerate the healing of wounds by 50%. The 30th of March a 1,000-year-old treatment for eye infections, containing onion, garlic and part of a cow's stomach, has been shown to completely wipe out Staphylococcus aureus, the antibiotic-resistant superbug known as MRSA. Eating pesticide-laden foods is linked to remarkably low sperm count 49% lower, say Harvard scientists in a landmark new study connecting pesticide residues in fruits and vegetables to reproductive health. Scientists have developed tiny nanoneedles that successfully prompted parts of mice bodies to generate new blood vessels. It is hoped this technique could ultimately help damaged organs and nerves to repair themselves and help transplanted organs to thrive. <laughs> April The 1st of April, new research reveals that, as the Arctic region warms and melts, polar bears forced ashore will be unable to gain sufficient food on land. Two-thirds of polar bears could be lost by 2050 and the species could be extinct by 2100. The 2nd of April, Northwestern medicine scientists identify a small RNA molecule called MIR-182 that can suppress cancer-causing genes in mice with glioblastoma muliform GBM, a deadly and incurable type of brain tumor. The 4th of April, a total lunar eclipse occurs. The 5th of April, the Large Hadron Collider resumes operations after a two-year technology upgrade and various maintenance delays. The 6th of April, glaciers in western Canada will lose 70% of their volume by 2100, according to a study by the University of British Columbia. 7 April, scientists from Iran research on a new method to let users to scan 3D photos with only their smartphone. The result was published in a media titled Nanophotonic Coherent Imager in the February 2015 issue of Optics Express. 8 April DARPA announces a new project that aims to create a computer program able to continuously scan its environment, evolving and adapting autonomously for the next 100 years. Complex organic molecules have been detected in a young star system for the first time. Iranian researchers make magnetic recyclable photo catalyst to refine dirty water. 9 April, Iranian researchers apply ultrasound waves to create fullerene. This approach is in agreeing with green chemistry basics and it is biocompatible. 10 April, an almost completely intact skeleton of a terror bird is found in Argentina. Analysis suggests these predators had good low-frequency hearing and deep voices. 13 April, the U.S. Federal Communications Commission publishes the final rule on its new net neutrality regulations. 14 April Stone tools found at Lomekwi 3 are dated to 3.3 million years ago, which, if confirmed, would represent the oldest known stone tools. NASA releases the first color image of Pluto, a dwarf planet, and its moon Charon, taken by the New Horizons spacecraft, image. Scientists report, based on results from the Rosetta and Philae spacecraft, that the nucleus of comet 67P, Churyumov gerasimenko has no magnetic field, which suggests that magnetism may not have played a role in the early formation of planetesimals. A search for possible heat signatures of advanced extraterrestrial civilizations reveals it has found nothing obvious in 100,000 galaxies. Iranian scientists assess the dynamic effect in connecting two carbon nanotubes. 
the 15th of April Following groundbreaking studies on mice, American scientists claim to have found a potential cause of Alzheimer's disease in the behavior of immune cells, which it may be possible to target with drug treatments. Researchers uncover evidence of a cannibalistic ritual that occurred in a British cave roughly 14,700 years ago. The 16th of April a major advance in artificial photosynthesis is achieved with a system able to capture CO2 using solar energy and then use it to produce valuable chemical products. Modification of histones in the DNA of nematodes, fruit flies, and possibly humans can affect aging, researchers claim. Scientists say the first detailed kinematic study of octopus arm coordination in crawling show that the animals have a special system control tactic to fix their odd form. Iranian researchers have produced a type of nanocatalyst which improves the performance of fuel cells. The 17th of April, Bouvier's red colobus, a species of monkey last seen in the 1970s and thought to have been extinct, is rediscovered in the Republic of Congo. The 20th of April, Japan announces plans to send an unmanned lunar rover to the moon's surface in 2018. The 21st of April, the Japanese L0 series maglev becomes the first train to operate at a speed of 600 km per hour, 370 miles per hour. Researchers demonstrate Wi-Fi FO, Wi-Fi free space optic, a technology capable of increasing the bandwidth of Wi-Fi systems tenfold using optical data transmission via LED lights. The 22nd of April Astronomers have made the first ever direct detection of the spectrum of visible light reflected off an exoplanet. Researchers in China publish results of basic research using CRISPR to edit genes in non-viable human embryos. The 23rd of April Two huge magma chambers have been imaged in 3D below Yellowstone National Park. For the first time, signals relating to the constant ringing noise of tinnitus have been mapped across the brain of a patient undergoing surgery. An international team of scientists has sequenced the complete genome of the woolly mammoth. Researchers at the University of Toronto in Canada have developed a new algorithm for showing protein structures in 3D, based on 2D images, which is 100,000 times faster than current methods. A new gene editing technique is reported that could prevent mitochondrial diseases, without the need for three-parent IVF. The 27th of April, archaeologists discover fossil remnants of an ancient human species, dating from roughly 430,000 years ago, in two sites in Italy. The 28th of April, a study from Arizona State University reveals the action of an experimental blood pressure drug in unprecedented detail, potentially aiding the development of new and better drugs. British and American psychologists claimed persecuting in school days result to at least mental health difficulties in adulthood. The 29th of April Scientists report finding a Scansoriopterygi dinosaur, named Yi Chi, strange wing, that may have flown without feathers. The World Health Organization WHO declares that rubella has been eradicated from the Americas. Two critical steps towards a practical quantum computer are achieved by IBM scientists, who demonstrate the ability to detect and measure both kinds of quantum errors simultaneously, as well as building a new, square quantum bit circuit design that is the only physical architecture that could successfully scale to larger dimensions. The 30th of April 
NASA's Messenger spacecraft concludes its four-year orbital mission over Mercury by crashing into the planet at a velocity of approximately 14,080 km per hour 8,750 miles per hour, impacting at 54.4 degrees north, 149.9 degrees west, near the crater Janáček. Tesla Motors reveals a new large-scale battery technology for homes and businesses, which will provide a means of storing energy from localized renewables and a reliable backup system during power outages. Progeria researchers have shown how the disorganization of DNA contributes to the cell disorder and is linked to aspects of aging. Topic. May The 3rd of May, astronomers report detection of a most distant galaxy, EGS ZS821, with an estimated distance of 13.1 billion light years. The 5th of May Researchers develop a centimeter-accurate GPS-based positioning system that could revolutionize geolocation on VR headsets, cell phones, drones and other technologies. Vehicle manufacturer Daimler announces that its Freightliner Inspiration truck has become the world's first autonomous truck to be granted a license for road use in the state of Nevada. Archaearnathura mimani, a new species of prehistoric bird that represents the oldest known member of the modern bird lineage, is discovered. The 6th of May Atmospheric CO2 remained above 400 parts per million ppm throughout March 2015, the first time it has been at this level for an entire month, according to NOAA. The current concentration of greenhouse gases is the highest it has been for millions of years. Scientists announce a 2020 unmanned mission, named HOPE, to the planet Mars by the United Arab Emirates, to study the Martian atmosphere and climate. A 3D technology known as tomosynthesis is shown to detect 40% more breast cancers than mammography, while lowering the radiation dose. Scientists announce discovery of Lochiarchaeata, which is a transitional form between archaea and eukaryotes. The 12th of May the Australian Government's Bureau of Meteorology confirms that the tropical Pacific is in the early stages of an El Niño that is likely to persist in the coming months. New evidence has been uncovered that global warming will damage wheat yields, resulting in a 15% loss when average temperatures increase by 2 degrees Celsius and a 40% decline when average temperatures rise by 4 degrees. The 13th of May, for the first time, the phase brightness variations in exoplanets have been measured to see the day-night cycle of exoplanetary weather dynamics. The 14th of May, researchers confirm that strong warming is taking place in the upper troposphere, a phenomenon long predicted in global warming theory and climate models. The 15th of May, Larsen B and C, a pair of ice shelves in the Antarctic, are reportedly at risk of collapse in the near future, potentially adding several centimeters to global sea levels. Researchers have taken a step towards large-scale fabrication of graphene, using chemical vapor deposition to produce composites containing 2-inch by 2-inch sheets of the material. The OPA is confirmed as the first known warm-blooded fish, able to regulate the temperature of its entire body. The 18th of May, scientists have reactivated neuroplasticity in older mice, restoring their brains to a more youthful state. The 19th of May, playing natural sounds such as flowing water in offices can boost worker moods and improve cognitive abilities, in addition to providing speech privacy, according to a new study. 
The 20th of May, NASA reports the Kepler Space Observatory observed KSN 2011b, A type Ia supernova in the process of exploding, before, during, and after. Details of the pre nova moments may help scientists better understand dark energy. The 21st of May NASA reports the most luminous galaxy yet discovered is Galaxy Wise J2246075705263 0.0. Smaller than the Milky Way galaxy, this dusty galaxy releases 10,000 times more energy. Nearly 100% of the light emitted from Galaxy Wise J2246075705263 is infrared radiation. Image Scientists have observed a sudden increase of ice loss in a previously stable region of Antarctica. The ice loss is so large that it causes small changes in the gravity field of the Earth. The 22nd of May, researchers have developed algorithms that enable robots to learn motor tasks through trial and error using a process that more closely approximates the way humans learn, marking a major milestone in the field of artificial intelligence. The 25th of May, a new technique to create a single molecule diode has been developed by scientists, and, in doing so, they have developed molecular diodes that perform 50 times better than all prior designs. The 27th of May, glacier volume in the Everest region of the Himalayas could be reduced between 70% and 99% by 2100, unless greenhouse gas emissions are curbed, according to a new study by the European Geosciences Union. The 28th of May, a new species of ancient hominid, Australopithecus dearamida, is uncovered in Ethiopia, with jaw bones and teeth dating to between 3.3 meters and 3.5 meters years old. The 29th of May, researchers have developed a new shape memory material that stays strong even after tens of millions of transformations. A new version of the cheetah robot has been demonstrated with the ability to jump over obstacles while running. The 30th of May, a new treatment for lung cancer using a drug called nivolumab has been shown to more than double life expectancy in some patients. Topic. June The 1st of June, a new study has linked rapid Arctic ice loss to extreme weather changes in Europe and the U.S. The 2nd of June, NASA reports that the ALICE spectrograph on the Rosetta Space Probe studying Comet 67P, churyumov gerasimenko 67P, determined that electrons within 1 km miles above the comet nucleus produced from photoionization of water molecules by solar radiation, and not photons from the Sun as thought earlier, are responsible for the degradation of water and carbon dioxide oxide molecules released from the comet nucleus into its coma. Researchers have discovered a key protein required to maintain muscle mass and muscle strength during aging. For the first time, researchers have created a lab-grown limb of a rat. California-based Tri Alpha Energy has shown a tenfold improvement in its ability to contain the hot particles needed for fusion. The 3rd of June. The Large Hadron Collider is reactivated after a two-year pause, during which upgrades and repairs were taking place. The machine is now able to experiment with higher energies, increasing from 8 to 13 trillion electron volts TeV. The 4th of June. Using new global surface temperature data, scientists at NOAA have shown that the rate of global warming in the last 15 years has not slowed, eliminating the hiatus. 
For the first time, a computer intelligence without direct human help has produced a model of regeneration. Warming ocean temperatures and decreasing oxygen levels will significantly shift marine habitats in the future, according to a study by the University of Washington. Researchers have achieved a significant breakthrough in combating antibiotic resistance using phages. The 8th of June NASA reports that impact glass has been detected on the planet Mars. Such material may contain preserved signs of ancient life. Related image May 2015 was the wettest month on record for the contiguous U.S., according to NOAA. Engineers at Stanford University have developed a state-by-state -state plan to convert the U.S. to 100% clean, renewable energy by 2050. The 9th of June, researchers have discovered what appear to be the remnants of red blood cells and connective tissue in 75 million year old dinosaur fossils. The 10th of June, a woman in Belgium is the first in the world to give birth to a baby using transplanted ovarian tissue frozen when she was still a child, doctors say. The 14th of June, news reports announce that the Philae lander, part of the Rosetta space mission, on the comet 67P, Churyumov gerasimenko has woken up from hibernation and is communicating with Earth. The 15th of June, researchers have sequenced and assembled the first full genome of a living organism using technology the size of smartphone. A study published in the British Medical Journal finds that consuming up to 100 grams of chocolate every day is linked to lowered heart disease and stroke risk. The 16th of June, the eastern cougar is declared extinct by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service. The 17th of June, Astronomers report evidence, for the first time, of the existence of the very early stars that may have provided the chemical elements needed for the later formation of planets and life as we know it. These very old population three stars are postulated to have been formed after the Big Bang, when the universe was about 800 million years old, and may have been detected in galaxy Cosmos Redshift 7 CR7, about 12.9 billion light years from Earth. The world's thinnest light source is created using graphene. The 18th of June, by reactivating a single gene, colorectal cancer cells in mice stop growing and re-establish normal intestinal function within four days, according to a study published in the journal Cell. The 19th of June, a major study confirms that Earth is currently witnessing the start of a mass extinction event the likes of which have not been seen for at least 65 million years. It is being precipitated by human actions over the past 500 years. The 20th of June, a titanium 3D printed prosthetic jaw is successfully implanted in a male patient by surgeons in Melbourne, Australia. The 23rd of June, the Sentinel-2A Earth observation satellite is launched. The 24th of June, Astronomers report the discovery of a brand new type of planet, resembling a giant comet. GJ 436b is a warm Neptune, located 33 light years from Earth and features a huge cloud of gas trailing away from its parent red dwarf star. Researchers identify a protein on tiny particles, GPC1 plus Crexos, released by pancreatic cancer cells, which may help in detecting the illness at its earliest stage. The 25th of June A new compound, MM41, is shown to reduce pancreatic cancer tumors by 80% in mice. Google demonstrates a new AI chatbot that is able to remember facts, understand contexts and perform common sense reasoning, all with fewer hand-crafted rules.
The 26th of June, all of the biggest impact craters on Earth have now been identified, with none left to be found at 6 kilometers (3.7 miles) or greater width, according to a study by geophysicists. The 27th of June, SpaceX CRS-7, a cargo resupply mission to the International Space Station, explodes shortly after launch. The 29th of June, the dwarf planet Pluto passes between a distant star and the Earth producing a shadow on the Earth near New Zealand that allows SOFIA, an airborne observatory, to study the atmosphere of Pluto. The 30th of June, a new model created by mathematicians and physicists suggests a big rip end to the universe. Topic. July The 2nd of July Scientists report that active pits, related to sinkhole collapses and possibly associated with outbursts, have been found on the comet 67P, Churyumov gerasimenko by the Rosetta space probe. The first comprehensive analysis of the mammoth genome is completed, revealing a number of traits that enabled the animals to survive in the Arctic cold. The 8th of July Astronomers report the discovery of an extremely rare five-star system. Scientists announce a project, as part of the Global Genome Initiative, to sample and freeze DNA from half of the world's plant species within two years. The 9th of July The FDA toughens warnings of increased heart attack and stroke risk associated with pain relievers containing ibuprofen, like Advil, Aleve, Motrin and related nonsteroidal anti-inflammatory drugs NSAID. Tylenol, containing acetaminophen, is not an NSAID and is not affected by the new warnings. However, aspirin is an NSAID but is not affected by the new warnings. IBM announces a breakthrough in the manufacture of 7 nanometers computer chips that will enable the trend of Moore's law to continue for the next few years. The 13th of July, researchers at the Large Hadron Collider report observing two exotic particles belonging to a new class, pentaquarks. The 14th of July NASA's New Horizons spacecraft performs a close flyby of Pluto, becoming the first spacecraft in history to visit the distant world. It will explore the area for five months, before entering the Kuiper Belt and eventually leaving the solar system. The latest State of the Climate report confirms that 2014 was the hottest year on record globally. The 16th of July Scientists report the discovery of the whale fermion after an 85-year search. This massless quasiparticle could help in the development of future electronics such as quantum computing. A new study adds to the growing evidence that polar bears are unable to adapt to a warming Arctic. The 17th of July, nanowires are used by Dutch researchers to boost solar fuel cell efficiency tenfold, while using 10,000 times less precious material. The 20th of July, Stephen Hawking, British physicist, helps launch a well-funded effort, called Breakthrough Initiatives, to search for extraterrestrial life and attempt to answer the question, are we alone? Through private and international partnerships, the cost of colonizing the Moon could be reduced by 90%, according to a joint study released by the National Space Society and the Space Frontier Foundation and reviewed by an independent team of experts. The 21st of July 
The latest global analysis of temperature data from NOAA shows that the first half of 2015 was the hottest such period on record, at 0.85 degrees Celsius above the 20th century average, surpassing the previous record set in 2010 by 0.09 degrees Celsius the Earth also experienced its hottest ever June. Men who become fathers experience weight gain and an increase in body mass index according to a new, large-scale study that tracked more than 10,000 men over a 20-year period. Men who didn't become dads actually lost weight over the same time period. A new computer program is the first to recognize sketches more accurately than a human. A potential new class of antibiotics based on modified sugar molecules is reported. The 22nd of July The results of a trial involving 1,322 patients shows further evidence that solanezumab can slow Alzheimer's disease. U.S. firm Second Sight announces the first age-related macular degeneration patient has received its Argus II bionic eye, at Manchester Royal Eye Hospital in the UK, as part of a groundbreaking study. A promising new treatment using eye drops to treat cataracts is reported by the University of California, San Diego. The 23rd of July NASA announces the discovery of Kepler 452b, a confirmed exoplanet that is near Earth size and found orbiting the habitable zone of a Sun-like star. A provocative new paper by climate scientists including James Hansen warns that future sea level rises may have been dramatically underestimated, and that even 2 degrees Celsius of global warming is highly dangerous. Intel and Micron unveil 3D X-Point, a new memory technology that is 1,000 times faster than NAND and 10 times denser than conventional DRAM. The 24th of July, the 133-million-year-old fossil of Tetrapodophus amplectus, the first four-legged snake to be found, is reported by paleontologists in Brazil. The 29th of July. The current world population of 7.3 billion is predicted to reach 8.5 billion by 2030, 9.7 billion in 2050 and 11.2 billion in 2100, according to a new analysis of data by the UN. The first artificial ribosome is created, by researchers at the University of Illinois at Chicago and Northwestern University. The 30th of July. Scientists report that the Philae spacecraft, that landed on Comet 67P, Churyumov Gerasimenko in November 2014, detected at least 16 organic compounds, of which four, including acetamide, acetone, methyl isocyanate, and propionaldehyde, were detected for the first time on a comet. The first aurora beyond the solar system is reported, on a brown dwarf 18 light years from Earth. Astronomers report the discovery of HD 219134b, a rocky exoplanet, due to its size of 1.6 Earth and density of 6 grams per cc, that is the closest such exoplanet to Earth, at 21.25 light years away. A new technique for obtaining nanoscale images of the brain at higher resolution than ever before is announced by Boston scientists. The 31st of July. An Ebola vaccine developed by the Public Health Agency of Canada is found to be 100% successful in an initial trial. By studying the structure and temperature of butterfly wings, researchers have observed physical properties that could hugely improve the efficiency of solar energy. Topic: August. 
the 3rd of august Researchers have demonstrated that even if a geoengineering solution to CO2 emissions could be found, it would not be enough to save the oceans. A new comprehensive analysis of global glacier changes in the Journal of Glaciology concludes that melting rates are unprecedented and faster than ever. The 4th of August the FDA approves Spritum, the first 3D printed pill. Spicy foods are linked to increased longevity in a study published by the British Medical Journal. Plans are unveiled by Plymouth University for Mayflower Autonomous Research Ship, Mars, the world's first full sized, fully autonomous unmanned ship to cross the Atlantic Ocean. The first ever genetic analysis of people with extremely high intelligence reveals small but important genetic differences between some of the brightest people in the United States and the general population. The 5th of August, astronomers at the Keck Observatory announce a new record for the most distant galaxy ever observed. Known as EGSY-8P7, its light needed 13.2 billion years to reach Earth. The 6th of August, the first known venomous frog species, Corythomantis greeningi and Aparisphenodon brunoi, are identified by researchers in Brazil. The 10th of August, by measuring the energy output from a large portion of the universe with greater precision than ever before, astronomers have determined that the universe is gradually fading across all wavelengths. In effect, the universe is slowly dying. The 13th of August. An endangered species, the black-footed ferret, is successfully reproduced using frozen sperm from a ferret that had been dead for 20 years. By altering a single gene, phosphodiesterase 4b, PDE 4b, researchers have increased the intelligence of mice, while decreasing their fear and anxiety. This raises hopes of better treatments for human cognitive disorders in the future. The 17th of August, based on studies with the Lunar Atmosphere and Dust Environment Explorer LADI spacecraft, NASA scientists report the detection of neon in the exosphere of the Moon. The 19th of August, NASA reports that there is no scientific basis that the world will end due to a rumored impact of an asteroid near Puerto Rico between 15 and 28 September 2015. NASA scientists report that the Dynamic Albedo of Neutrons Dan instrument on the Curiosity rover detected an unusual hydrogen-rich area, at Maria's Pass, on Mars. The hydrogen found seems related to water or hydroxyl ions in rocks within three feet beneath the rover, according to the scientists. People working a 55-hour week have a 33% increased risk of stroke than those working a 35- to 40-hour week, along with a 13% increased risk of coronary heart disease, according to a study published in The Lancet. Researchers at George Washington University demonstrate a process that turns atmospheric carbon dioxide into carbon nanofibers. The Sumatran rhinoceros is declared extinct in the wild in Malaysia. Using stem cells, researchers have developed a miniature human brain in a dish with the equivalent maturity of a five-week-old fetus. It is believed this model, the most advanced of its kind ever created, could be used for better and more accurate testing of drugs. The 20th of August July 2015 was the hottest month on Earth since records began in 1880, according to data from NOAA. A new report in the journal Science underscores the need for improved management and protection of boreal forests in response to global changes this century. The 21st of August A new study published in Nature removes any doubt 
that rising levels of greenhouse gases were the primary driver of glacier retreat during the end of the last ice age. Giant galaxies with an absence of young stars are more suitable for habitable planets, researchers say. The 24th of August A new way of switching off cancer cell growth, using the PLEKHA7 protein, is reported by the Mayo Clinic. Physicists achieve a breakthrough in fusion power, by containing superheated hydrogen plasma for 5 milliseconds, longer than any other effort before. The 26th of August, in a press briefing, NASA scientists warn that future sea level rise has been underestimated. The 28th of August, in a landmark study of scientific reproducibility published in Science, a group of 270 psychologists attempted to directly replicate 100 psychology studies from three top-tier psychological journals and found that about one-third to one-half of the original findings could be successfully reproduced. The 31st of August, scientists claim to have discovered the first new human prion in almost 50 years. Topic: September. The 1st of September, scientists report the discovery of Pentacopterus decorayens, the oldest described Eurypterida sea scorpions, an extinct arthropod group that lived as early as 467.3 million years ago. With an estimated length of up to 1.83 meters 6 feet 0 in, it has been described as the first real big predator. The 2nd of September A report by Climate Action Tracker warns that pledges by governments for the upcoming UN Climate Change Conference in Paris, are grossly inadequate if the rise in global temperatures is to be kept below 2 degrees Celsius. There are just over 3 trillion trees on Earth, according to a new assessment. The 3rd of September Researchers at MIT demonstrate the first 3D printing technique able to make transparent glass objects. Philips introduces the world's first quantum dot monitor. Scientists working on the Large Hadron Collider report that the production of quark-gluon plasma, a state of matter present in the early universe, is possible with fewer particles than previously thought. 7 September, a bright fireball over Thailand, believed to be a belide, is seen in Bangkok and some other locations. 10 September Paleontologists report a new human-like species, Homo naledi, based on the discovery of 15 partial skeletons, the largest single find of its type in Africa. It is believed that H. naledi could have lived in Africa up to three million years ago and were capable of ritualistic behavior. Although the discoverers claim the bones represent a new species of early humans, other experts contend that more evidence is needed before such a claim can be justified. A report by scientists, ethicists and policy experts from the Hingston Group states that research into genetically modified human embryos is essential, and that GM babies could be morally acceptable in the future. The 11th of September NASA releases the first clear images of Pluto's small moon Nix, showing rough edges and a prominent crater. A study by the British Psychological Society warns that constant pressure on teenagers to use social media technology causes lower sleep quality, lower self-esteem, higher anxiety and increased depression levels. Through DARPA, a 28-year-old paralyzed man becomes the first person to feel physical sensations through a prosthetic hand directly connected to his brain. 13 September, a partial solar eclipse occurred. 14 September 
first observation of gravitational waves, announced the 11th of February 2016. The next two years could be the hottest on record globally, according to research by the UK's Met Office. Astronomers report unusual light fluctuations of KIC 8462852, an F-type main sequence star in the constellation Cygnus, as detected by the Kepler Space Telescope, while searching for exoplanets. Various explanations have been presented, including those based on comets, asteroids, as well as, an alien civilization. 15 September, NASA's Cassini probe finds a global ocean lying beneath the icy crust of Saturn's geologically active moon Enceladus. 16 September It is reported that oil companies knew that burning oil and gas could cause global warming since the 1970s but, nonetheless, funded deniers for years. A study by WWF and the Zoological Society of London finds that populations of marine mammals, birds, fish and reptiles have declined by 49% since 1970. The report highlights tuna and mackerel as in a particularly dire state, having declined 74%. The 22nd of September. Researchers announce discovery of the second known human pegavirus, HPGV2. Researchers teleport quantum information carried in light particles over 100 km of optical fiber, four times farther than the previous record. Scientists announce the discovery of a new dinosaur species, Eugrunolic kuikpikensis, a 30-foot-long plant eater, that lived 69 million years ago above the Arctic Circle, the farthest north of any known dinosaur. The 23rd of September A NASA study indicates that oceanic phytoplankton are declining significantly in the northern hemisphere. Tiny carbon capturing motors are developed at the University of California, potentially offering a way to absorb carbon dioxide from the oceans. The 24th of September A paraplegic American man walks again using a computer system that reroutes signals from his brain to electrodes on his knees. Scientists build a wrench just 1.7 nanometers wide, providing a fundamentally new way to control the shape of molecules. The 27th of September, a total lunar eclipse, dubbed a supermoon, because of its apparent larger size in the sky, takes place over Europe, the Middle East, Africa, and the Americas. The next supermoon eclipse will not occur until October 2033. The 28th of September NASA scientists, including Lugendra Oja et al., report evidence, for the first time, supporting the presence of liquid water in the form of liquid brine currently flowing on the planet Mars conference videos. Angustapila dominicae, the smallest snail ever found, is reported in southern China. The species measures just 0.86 mm in height. Researchers at Queen Mary University of London demonstrate a self-assembling organic material that grows and changes shape, which could lead to artificial arteries. Because of warming oceans, king crabs threaten to overrun Antarctic marine ecosystems within a few decades, according to research by the Florida Institute of Technology. The 29th of September, researchers develop a new test, ViroCap, that can detect nearly any virus known to infect humans and animals. The researchers are making the technology publicly available worldwide, for the benefit of patients and research. October 
The 1st of October, IBM announces a breakthrough that could accelerate the replacement of silicon transistors with carbon nanotubes and work down to 1.8 nanometers node sizes. The 2nd of October, a new study adds to previous findings that dinosaurs were driven to extinction by a combination of increased volcanism at the Deccan Traps and the Chicxulub asteroid impact. Fusion reactors could be economically viable within a few decades, and policy makers should start planning to build them as a replacement for conventional nuclear power stations, according to research by Durham University. The 5th of October. Nearly one-third of cacti species face extinction, according to the first comprehensive global assessment, largely due to illegal trade and other human activity. NASA reports recurrent slope lineae, wet brine flows, may have been detected on Mount Sharp near the Curiosity rover. In addition, an estimated 20,000 to 40,000 heat-resistant bacterial spores were on the Curiosity rover at launch. As many as 1,000 times more than that may not have been counted. The 6th of October Takaaki Kajita and Arthur B. MacDonald win the 2015 Nobel Prize in Physics for the discovery of neutrino oscillations, which shows that neutrinos have mass. Researchers build a quantum logic gate in silicon for the first time, making calculations between two qubits of information possible, and thereby clearing the final hurdle to making silicon quantum computers a reality. The 7th of October, Tomas Lindahl, Paul L. Modrich and Aziz Sanjar win the 2015 Nobel Prize in Chemistry, for explaining the basic mechanisms that help to guard the integrity of our genomes. The 8th of October, NASA releases details of its long-term plan for human exploration of Mars. NASA confirms, based on results from the Curiosity rover and Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter, that lakes and streams existed in Gale Crater on Mars 3.3 to 3.8 billion years ago delivering sediments to build up the lower layers of Mount Sharp. NASA announces that the New Horizons spacecraft has detected blue skies and water ice on Pluto. Scientists confirm that a third global coral bleaching event is underway that is likely to be the most intense ever recorded. Up to 1 billion people are at risk of blindness by 2050, according to researchers at the Brian Holden Vision Institute. Following a comprehensive, 10-year effort, researchers identify 238 genes that affect aging in yeast cells. The 13th of October Astronomers discover V774104, an object which initially appeared to have a 103 astronomical units distance from the Sun, which would have made it the furthest known object from the Sun. Upon public release of the object in March 2018, it was only 90 astronomical units from the Sun, making it only the third furthest known object. Scientists achieve a breakthrough in finding a general cure for cancer by attaching malaria proteins to cancer cells, which appears effective on 90% of cancer types. Human trials are expected to begin within four years. Forensic scientists report a chemical procedure that can identify gender from a fingerprint. The fingerprint test is based on the much higher levels of certain amino acids in the perspiration of women than in men. The 14th of October, scientists report finding fossil evidence of life on the very young Earth 4.1 billion years ago, 300 million years older than known earlier. According to one of the researchers, if life arose relatively quickly on Earth, then it could be common in the universe. The 15th of October Researchers at Stockholm University develop a material for capturing CO2 in the presence of water. 
Chattanooga announces that a public utility will offer the world's first 10 gigabit broadband service across a large community-wide territory. The 20th of October. Sulfur limonene polysulfide is used to synthesize a new material able to cheaply and efficiently absorb mercury pollution from soils and water. Researchers in California use big data to identify over 100 novel cancer driver genes. Sunscreen chemicals such as oxybenzone may be contributing to the decline of coral reefs popular with tourists, according to a study by the University of Central Florida. The 21st of October The first direct observation of a solar system being torn apart by a white dwarf is described in the journal Nature. The star, known as WD 1145-017, is transited by at least one, and probably several, disintegrating planetesimals, with periods ranging from 4.5 hours to 4.9 hours. Astronomers using the ESO Very Large Telescope identify the hottest and most massive contact binary. The double star system, VFTS 352, is located 160,000 light years away in the Tarantula Nebula, which is part of the Large Magellanic Cloud. Scientists report that the quantum entanglement phenomenon is strongly supported based on a loophole free bell test study. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration NOAA reports that September's global average temperature was the largest departure from normal for any month on record. The eastern Santa Cruz tortoise Chelinoides donfaustoi, a newly discovered species of giant tortoise on the Galapagos Islands, is described in the journal PLOS One. The European Space Agency reports that Oxia Planum on the planet Mars is the preferred landing site for the ExoMars rover. The 22nd of October, a new gene therapy cures muscular dystrophy in dogs, with human trials expected to follow in the next few years, according to researchers at the University of Missouri. The 23rd of October, Hurricane Patricia becomes the most intense tropical cyclone ever observed in the Western Hemisphere in terms of barometric pressure and the strongest globally in terms of maximum sustained winds. U.S. physicists use lasers to create positrons, the antiparticle of electrons, in record numbers and density. The 26th of October the International Agency for Research on Cancer of the World Health Organization reports that eating processed meat e.g., bacon, ham, hot dogs, sausages or red meat is linked to some cancers. A new study by MIT predicts that extreme heatwaves will make large parts of the Gulf region intolerable for humans in the late 21st century. The 27th of October Researchers at the University of Bristol create a tractor beam using holograms made of sound waves, able to move small objects from up to 40 centimeters away. Using computer models of geoengineering, a study in PNAS shows that a halving of Katrina-sized hurricanes over the next half century might be possible, but only if a new and safer aerosol can be found. The 28th of October, NASA Administrator, Charlie Bolden, presents the next steps for a human journey to Mars at the Center for American Progress in Washington, D.C. The 29th of October, NASA Office of Inspector General issues a health hazards report related to human missions to Mars. The 30th of October, researchers at the VUMC Cancer Center Amsterdam develop a blood test that, from a single drop of blood, can diagnose cancer with a probability of 97%, and about 6-8% probability of a false diagnosis, in healthy patients. 
The 31st of October, asteroid 2015 TB145, a near-Earth asteroid roughly 600 meters (2000 feet) in diameter, passes 1.27 lunar distances from Earth. Topic: November The 4th of November, New Horizons completes the last in a series of four maneuvers putting it on course for a rendezvous with 2014 MU69 in January 2019, a billion miles beyond Pluto. This propulsive maneuver is the most distant trajectory correction ever performed by any spacecraft. The 5th of November. NASA scientists report, based on results from the MAVEN orbiter circling Mars, that the solar wind is responsible for stripping away the atmosphere of Mars over the years. A chemical that could potentially be used in eye drops to reverse cataracts, the leading cause of blindness, is identified by scientists at the University of California. In a world first, gene-edited immune cells are used to treat incurable leukemia in a one-year-old girl. Stem cell scientists at the University Health Network identify an entirely new two-tier process of how blood is made, overturning decades of established science. The researchers claim their finding could lead to radically improved and personalized treatments for blood disorders. The 11th of November Groundwork begins on the 24.5 meters Giant Magellan Telescope. Early operations are expected to begin by 2021, with full operations by 2025. Scientists report finding a 110,000 years old tooth fossil containing DNA from Denisovan hominin, an extinct species of human in the genus Homo. The 12th of November, NASA scientists report that human-made carbon dioxide (CO2) continues to increase above levels not seen in hundreds of thousands of years. Currently, about half of the carbon dioxide released from the burning of fossil fuels remains in the atmosphere and is not absorbed by vegetation and the oceans. MIT invents an efficient new shockwave-based process for the desalination of water. The huge Zachariai Istrum Glacier in Greenland, which holds enough water to raise global sea levels by half a meter, is reported to be melting and crumbling into the North Atlantic Ocean. The 16th of November Scientists report that Haramiavia, a type of Haramida living about 200 million years ago and at first thought to be the earliest known herbivores among very early mammals, may not have been mammals after all, but part of a more ancestral side branch instead. Iranian researchers at the University of Tehran demonstrate the latest generation of their humanoid robot, Serena 3. Nano-scale submarines built from 244 atoms and capable of moving at 1 inch per second are demonstrated by Rice University. The 17th of November A point mutation in a gene of the serotonin 2B receptor is linked to impulsive behavior in humans, particularly those who are drunk, according to research by the University of Helsinki in Finland. Scientists develop a self-healing, flexible sensor that mimics the self-healing properties of human skin. Incidental scratches or cuts to the sensors heal themselves in less than one day. The 18th of November University of Washington engineers report the development of a novel technology that uses a Wi-Fi router to power devices. Astronomers at the University of Arizona capture the first image of an exoplanet being formed in a protoplanetary disk. The object, LKCA 15b, is located 450 light years away, orbiting a young star named LKCA 15. 
University of Massachusetts Medical School researchers have created a greatly improved implementation of CRISPR with potentially far-reaching implications. The 19th of November, for the first time, the FDA approves genetically modified salmon for human consumption. The 20th of November, doctors use virtual reality in surgery for the first time, which helps to clear the blocked coronary artery of a male patient. The 23rd of November, the genome of the tardigrade is published, revealing that 17.5% is foreign DNA from other organisms. It is the only animal able to survive in the vacuum of space. The 24th of November, a review of scientific literature by Bristol University finds no substantive evidence of a pause or hiatus in global warming. The 25th of November, by switching off, one by one, almost 18,000 genes—90% of the entire human genome. Scientists at the University of Toronto identified genes that are essential for cell survival. The 30th of November, the U.S. Geological Survey predicts that between 16 and 24 percent of Alaskan permafrost will disappear by 2100. Topic: December. 1 to 3 December the International Summit on Human Gene Editing is held in Washington The 1st of December Blood vessel like structures found in an 80 million year old hadrosaur fossil are confirmed to be original to the animal and not biofilm or other contaminants A new polarized 3D System developed by MIT can increase the resolution of conventional 3D imaging devices 1,000-fold. Epson debuts. PaperLab. The world's first office papermaking system that turns waste paper into new sheets. The 2nd of December, a new mass spectral imaging device at Colorado State University allows 3D mapping of cellular composition at a resolution of 75 nanometers wide and 20 nanometers deep, more than 100 times higher than was previously possible. The 3rd of December, the LISA Pathfinder mission is launched by ESA. Scientists of major world academies call for a moratorium on inheritable human genome edits, including those related to CRISPRCA's nine technologies. The 4th of December The Earth Institute at Columbia University publishes a study that reinforces previous findings that the medieval warm period was limited in extent and not global. Dams and irrigation raise the global human freshwater footprint almost 20% higher than previously thought, according to new research by Stockholm University. The 7th of December The Japanese Akatsuki probe, which failed to orbit Venus in 2010, is reported to have succeeded following a second attempt. Researchers at Eindhoven University of Technology create the world's smallest temperature sensor, powered by radio waves, which they say could be used in developing the Internet of Things. The 9th of December The world's first test tube. Puppies created through IVF are born in the U.S. after years of attempts. NASA scientists report that the bright spots on the dwarf planet Ceres, including those in Ceres' largest bright spot region located in a Cater crater, may be related to a type of salt, particularly a form of brine containing magnesium sulfate hexahydrite magnesium sulfate 6H2O. The spots were also found to be associated with ammonia-rich clays. The 10th of December the first helium plasma test is conducted at the Wendelstein 7X fusion device. 
based on data from the Atacama Large Millimeter – Submillimeter Array – ALMA, astronomers report the possibility of a large super-Earth or planet X lurking at the far edges of the solar system in the direction of Alpha Centauri. The 11th of December Paleontologists report the discovery of Hualian Ceratops wakaiwanensis, an herbivorous Ceratopsian dinosaur that lived about 160 million years ago in western China. Disney Research unveils Face Director a new method of synthesizing an actor's facial performances in post-production to get just the right emotion, instead of reshooting the scene multiple times. OpenAI is founded. The 14th of December, a new atomic force microscope is announced by MIT, capable of scanning images 2,000 times faster than existing commercial models. This allows it to operate with near real-time video speed to capture structures as small as a fraction of a nanometer from single strands of DNA down to individual hydrogen bonds. The 15th of December Two teams of physicists, working independently at CERN, report preliminary hints of a possible new subatomic particle more specifically, the ATLAS and CMS experiments, using 13 TeV proton collision data, showed a moderate excess around 750 GeV. In the two-photon spectrum, if real, the particle could be either a heavier version of a Higgs boson or a graviton. A new world record for the smallest inkjet image is announced, after researchers in Switzerland used quantum dots to produce a 0.0092 square millimeters 80 micrometers by 115 micrometers color photo of tropical clown fish at a resolution of 25,000 dpi. The 16th of December, cancer is overwhelmingly a result of environmental factors, and not largely down to bad luck, a study by medical scientists suggests. Maintaining a healthy weight, eating a healthy diet, minimizing alcohol and eliminating smoking reduces the risk of developing the disease, according to researchers. The 17th of December, researchers develop a new big data statistical method, known as IGWAS, which identifies five longevity loci associated with healthy aging. The 19th of December, a final flyby of Enceladus, moon of Saturn, by the Cassini spacecraft, is reported by NASA. The 21st of December, U.S. company SpaceX, headed by Elon Musk, achieves a historic milestone in space flight by landing a Falcon 9 rocket vertically, demonstrating that cheaper reusable rockets might be possible. In response to the dramatic decline of lion populations in the wild, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service announces two lion subspecies as endangered and threatened. Panthera leo leo, found in India and Africa, is listed as endangered, and Panthera leo melanocheta, in eastern and southern Africa, is listed as threatened. The 22nd of December, NASA delays the launch of the InSight mission to Mars in March 2016, due to an air leak in one of the primary scientific instruments. The mission was launched in May 2018. The 28th of December, scientists report the discovery of a new type of basaltic rock, rich in ilmenite, a black mineral, on the Moon by Chang'e-3, a Chinese spacecraft that landed on the Moon in 2013. The 30th of December, the seventh row of the periodic table is officially declared full, after the discovery of elements 113, 115, 117 and 118. Topic. Awards Topic equals equals Queen Elizabeth Prize for Engineering, Robert S. Langer
UNESCO Medal for the Development of Nanoscience and Nanotechnologies, Valentin Bukhtoyarov, Constance Chong Hasnane, Sudabe Deverin, Vladimir Fortov, Mikhail Kovalchuk, Tabelo Nia Kong, Mikhail Selyanin, and Shem Wandiga. Deaths The 8th of January, John Duckworth, British physicist, B. 1916. The 20th of January, Lawrence Hogben, New Zealand meteorologist and naval officer, B.1916. The 27th of January, Charles H. Towns, American Nobel Prize winning physicist and contributor to the invention of the laser, B.1915. The 25th of February, Raymond Smallman, British metallurgist and academic, B. 1929. The 23rd of May, John Forbes Nash Jr., American mathematician, laureate of the Nobel Prize in Economics, 1994, subject of A Beautiful Mind, B. 1928. The 29th of June, Joseph Brian Nelson, British ornithologist and academic, B. 1932. The 30th of August, Oliver Sacks, British neurologist, B. 1933. The 30th of September, Guido Altarelli, Italian theoretical physicist, B. 1941. Equals equals see also